Oh, we finally made it in. Hey, y'all. This box is really heavy. Hi, you guys. Hi. I am, I think I'm going to put this box down now. But I just wanted to get on here and talk with you guys and um, talk about makeup because literally... I have so much stuff that I want to share that I can't do it all in one video. So I'd rather, hey, 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 y'all coming on through. Good morning. Thank you. I just did a video on this hair too. So I just have to edit that baby. Matter of fact, I am putting the information on my computer right now. Hey, Faith, how you doing? Hey, oh my gosh. Thank you guys so much for coming in and hanging out with me this morning. Well, it's almost afternoon, really. It's about to be. Uh-oh, hold on. Let me move closer because, girl, these comments are little. Yes. Yes, I can roller skate. Girl, I was brought up during the time of roller skating. My sister, my big sister and cousins took us to World on Wheels all the time. I don't know if you guys are from Cali and you know about World on Wheels. Hey, this box is so heavy. I don't even know how I'm going to get it down. Like, literally, my husband helped me get it up here. So, I don't know. So, hey, 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 hey. Hey from Jamaica. Thank you. Hey, I love getting on here and talking to y'all because y'all are the bomb.com. But I'm going to show you guys some makeup. Oh, uh, thank you. Now, I have a, I have a confession or uh, I don't even know if I want to say like, I don't even want to say disappointment, but it kind of is. So the skates in here, my feet are like scrunched up. Like, I don't even know what analogy to use, but they don't fit. So the minis. Probably, um, I don't know which one, whichever one fits it the best. Um, I'm using my cell phone. I use my cell phone to go live because it's easier for me. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's going quick. It's going quick. This is Too Faced. Girl, I can't hold it up. It's heavy. It is so heavy. This is the best I could do. It's like on my lap right now. That's all I could do. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. It's going quick. It's going quick. I love skating. I do own skates already though, but these are like bling skates. Like I can, hold on. I'm going to put this down. Ah, well, thank you, girl. I hope we kicking it on your break. Yes, these are their new latex, melted latex. So I'll probably swatch them on my arm and I'm going to try to do a lip swatch video with Minnie, but um, Minnie is a working girl now, a working woman, I should say, and she has a boo. So it's hard to get her. Hey from Sacramento. I love this box too, you guys. I'm going to have to put this in the garage so that um, when I get like a bigger space or when I get like an office where I can just, you know, have my own, I'm speaking it, I'm putting it out there, okay? So when I get an area where I want to display all my stuff, I can display this because this is too cute to throw away. It's too cute. Thank you. I just, this is my first time rocking this hair. So I did a video today too. And it's from my first wig. It is so bomb. I probably need to do a little work up in here, but I'm happy. I'm happy. No, no, it's two skates for sure. Oh, oh, you better believe that's happening. You better believe I'm gonna take her room. Matter of fact, I think I'll probably break this closet down and just use it as like organization. So anyway, let's get to it now that some people are in here. Girl, you got to speak it to ex it, speak it into existence. Woo! This is heavy. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Wait. This is su super heavy. Wait a minute. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Woo! That thing is heavy. Did y'all catch that hair flip though? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Thank you. Of course I'll reply. Yes, nibble is like my jam. And so then there's another package that I have, you guys. So you guys let me know what you want to see first, all right? So then this other package I have is from Makeup Forever. And I figured it would be more, it would be like more beneficial for both of us to just come on here, show you all this stuff, find out what you guys want to see first, and then I can go forth. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, that hair flip, girl, because I think red is my color. Yes, thank you. Hey, Vegas. The skate is a seven. Ain't nobody a seven. I'm not no seven. They're, I think they're they're like a seven, but I think they're more like an eight or eight and a half or something like that. But I'm a 10, so that just doesn't work for me. No kind of way. Thank you. Now this is from Makeup Forever. And these are their new, um, I think it's like, 
They are called um, Aqua XL Color Paint. And basically, you can use them as an eyeshadow base, a liner, and an eyeshadow. And so I wanted to do a video about that too. I think this is in collaboration with um, Kehlani. I guess she's like a, she's a singer. I really want to do that look. Y'all see what she's rocking with that yellow and the blue? I want to recreate that. What y'all think? I really want to recreate that and see how it would look. Because that's super cute. So that's really what I want to do with these. Um, I'm not going to do full swatches on here. I don't think I'm going to go through all the full swatches because when y'all see the other stuff I have, we're not going to have time. Otherwise, we're going to be on here all day. And I know y'all not about to kick it, kick it with me on y'all whole Saturday. You know what I mean? And then it came with a little cute little makeup bag. Hey, Tiki Beauty. Confidence is key. Ladies, you know what I mean. You better sing it. Thank you. I sent kisses right back. Mwah. I totally want to do it. Ooh, beach make, beach make, beach makeup tutorial is coming real, real soon. Wig review is coming. I just filmed it. But I'm going to tell you right now, I absolutely love my first wig. And they, they're they the ones that created this one too. My blonde one that I've been rocking. And this wig stand came from my first wig too. Because I don't have any. Can y'all believe that? Out of all the wigs I have, I don't, yeah. So anyway, um, I'm not about to go into all the details about the wig because I can't even, I have to look it up and everything. So I'll do that when I give you guys the video. That, that's funny. Aw, that is so bomb. So inside this makeup bag, they also, I be trying to look at y'all comments and I be trying to do the makeup thing. So like, yeah, I have a curly wig coming. It should be here any, I have a curly wig coming and I have another long wig coming. So yeah, yes, that's, I am wearing the Jaclyn Hill palette. Shout out to Jaclyn, cause that Roxanne, Roxanne, that's what I'm wearing. How'd you know? How'd you know? So for those of y'all, like I hope y'all don't mind, but I love chatting with y'all and I'm gonna show y'all stuff. Cause what's the purpose of doing a live video and I'm just ignoring all the comments? That's not how we get down over here, y'all know that. Oh, it's not a sweater, it's, it's a little shirt that has like a bunch of little holes in it cause it's hot. It was like 90 something yesterday and it's supposed to be 90 today. And I have my window open so if y'all hear a little bit of noise, this is what you get when we live stream and it's hot. Thank you. And so it had some liners inside of the makeup bag as well. Thank you, I appreciate that. Well, happy birthday, happy birthday and you all here? Ah, hey. Yes, my first wig is the name of the company. Matter of fact, let me see if I, cause I just put the box away. Hold on a second. Now I'm giving y'all, I'm giving y'all a sneak peek, but to be honest, I'm gonna be talking about this in a video too. But this is what the box looks like. It's called My First Wig. As a matter of fact, when I'm done with this live video, I probably will go ahead and link like this unit in there and give you guys the coupon code too. Cause I think they have a sale going on right now. Hey Bria. And then, um, then I'll come forth with the video because I just recorded it today. But I'll give you a little glimpse because if I was y'all watching and I saw this bomb right here, I would want to know too because they they really hooked it up. And I love how the roots are like, did I say roots? I love how the roots are like dark and then it kind of fades out. And oh, I, I'm just loving this red. The skate box, I can't lift it back up again, girl. Hubby came in and put it on me and I was able to hold it up. I'm not lifting that up no more. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you. Okay. I don't know how much it is. I, I will put the link when I'm done. Yes. Them ombre rets. No, I'm just kidding. This is okay. So I'm going to put this in the description box when the video is over. Cause I don't want to keep saying the lippy and stuff too. But, um, this is Morphe nibble. This is like one of my favorite, favorite of all time lippies. And I think these are $12.99, which I've always, like, I always talk about this lippy. I talk about it mostly on Snapchat and Instagram though. Oh, okay. So here we go. So this is inside the box. So you have now, wait, disclaimer. Let me just put this disclaimer out there. Let me hit you with a disclaimer. I am not a wig slayer. Okay. I've been wearing wigs for a couple of years yet. No, I haven't gone inside the box yet, but I've been rocking wigs for a few years, but I'm still not, um, I'm still not like, I don't call myself like a wig veteran. Like I, my first wig, I didn't have to pluck this or nothing. I literally just cut off the lace and flat ironed it a little bit and bam, life is great. And it smells really good and fresh and yeah. So anyway, this is an adjustable, I guess you put this on your wig. I've seen people do videos where they, um, I may do that wig look, but girl, I like the way you're thinking. 
but this is like a strap where you can i guess adjust it to fix your head i mean to fit your head and i have like a little pea size head so i probably need that in my life and then it comes with a um a rat tail comb and oh my gosh if y'all have followed me for any length of time let me sit up if y'all have followed me for any length of time, then y'all know that I love these because when I rock my buns, I just go in there and scratch girl when it itches and it doesn't disturb my bun. So yeah. Is it really? I've, I don't even know where I got this from and I had it for a long time. And then it comes with some bobby pins and then it has like a wig cap that's I guess like my skin tone, which I, I haven't used those when they send it to me. I usually use a black one. And then it comes, oh, then it comes with the wig information, but I'm not about to, I'm gonna have to, it's 12 inches that's what i do know i will yeah I'll, I'll put that in the description box it comes with some hair clips kisses and hugs back to you thank you and then it has this is what the hair came in it's like a little a bag that like protects your hair and then it has it's kind of like a makeup bag but i guess it's a hair care bag bomb.com you can use it for makeup and then it has an instruction pamphlet and it tells you and oh and it comes with that little wig stand that i showed you guys and that's it but it's so bomb and then you don't have to pluck it that's the whole thing they are a sister company to rb yeah i can't even talk right now i'm excited and i had coffee so beware beware okay but um uh what was i saying they are a sister company to rpg wigs but they are called my first wig because it's supposed to be easy for people that are beginners like that have never worn wigs before and they're beginners it makes it really easy i'm not gonna go over the lipstick again because i'll put that in the description box when i'm done yes thank th thank you faith girl okay yes yes that's it all right so the other box the other box that I have, and it's some other stuff. Oh, well, let's show you the box. For, it's, it's stuff, y'all. It's stuff. So the other box I have is from MAC. This is heavy too, you guys. It's from MAC, and it is. it says lips, 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 and they ain't never lied. Thank you so much. Okay. And, it, of course, it came with a little pamphlet thing. And this is the, like, oh, I don't know how I'm going to do this, y'all. And, woo! Oh, I could take it out. I could take it out. Hold on. Okay, so it's like this. This is even cuter. All right, so here we go. Thank you. So this is what it says, lips, 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 right? Yes, it's all Mac Lippy. So look at the bottom. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna just take it out like this, shall I? Okay, there we go. So then the trash man is out there. Y'all hear him, the garbage man? Mm, sorry anyway so they have all these lip glasses and then yes mac pr and then it has a lip primer at the bottom and i i think let me know what y'all think about this i'm thinking about doing like a swatch party and having some of my friends come over and the minis and we do a lip swatch for you guys on different skin tones not the lip glasses but probably lipsticks and just do like a lip swatch video for you guys and just have fun and I may even do it live, girl. I don't know. But what y'all think about that? So here's the next drawer. Wait, where is it? Hold on. Uh-oh. Y'all know this is live, so we don't know what we're going to get. Yeah, I think it'll be so fun. And then I think some of my friends would love to do it. They would love to do it because I'm telling you right now, me and the minis, we can't do this by ourselves. It's too much. Yeah, garbage man trying to mess up my flow. Okay, now these, here's another tray. And these are the MAC Retro Matte Lippies. These are like my favorite, favorite. <laughs> these are my favorite formula by MAC. I absolutely love them. They can be drying, but then I guess it like depends on the color. Cause some of them are like, girl, it's way drying. But all you gotta do is just aquaphor your lips all the way up. And then, you know, dab it a little bit and then put them on and you'll be fine. And so then it came with a bunch of lip liners. Now I will say that the only liner that's missing, and it's funny that I've never worn it, but it's cork. And I'm hearing that cork is like a favorite and it's not in here, but you got chestnut in here, you got vino, you have night moth and these, all of this stuff in this package, these are supposed to be the favorites or the, the um, what did they call it? Let me see what they called it y'all. They said something. Oh, here it is. I'm about to read this. They can be, but if you juice your lips up, you'll be fine. 
So it says, pucker up. Because we love you, we're giving you the best lip mac has to offer in one legendary package. And it says, um, yeah, ombre and da 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 So yeah, these are like their most, their most purchased lipsticks, I guess, okay? I don't know. See, when you ask about what your first purchase should be, that is something that you have to, it kind of depends on your preference. That's why I don't like to, I just like to show you guys stuff and then let you guys make, I'm trying to get the other one, let you guys make decisions based off of the information that I give you because it total, I don't know if you saw my last video about what you need to do or watch this before purchasing makeup. You guys have to know what your preference is, like what you're looking for. You know what I mean? I can't tell you what your first purchase would be. Like, are you looking for foundation? Are you looking for lipsticks? Um, what type of skin type? What What is your skin type? What's your, pre like, it's a lot that goes into it. You know what I mean? But yeah, you guys chime in and say what you love from MAC. But here's another tray. These are lippies. They're all lippies. They are their regular bullet lipsticks right here. And then... Don't be super nervous. Makeup is supposed to be fun. And then it's another tray. So this is all the stuff that's in here. And it's basically, these are, I don't think there's anything new in here. These are like, well, some of them are new. Like they're retro matte liquid lipsticks. They're pretty new, but these are the colors that everyone loves. And so that's the case. So I think I can get rid of that other thing, but that's what it looks like. And Again, I don't want to get rid of this container because this is the bomb.com. And so it came in this. And so I'm going to put that back. I'm going to put that back. And then I have one more package that... Whoop! Okay, now that wasn't cool. Listen, when we do live, y'all get, get raw and uncut. Here we go, get our life together. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Life is great, we're back. Uh-oh, I hear somebody coming. Hi. That's Minnie. Okay, woo! Lippies, it's just, it's just another word for lipsticks. Yes, 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 there you go. Yes. It's hot. Okay, so this other box. You can come say hi. You in here now. They can't see you. She has she has her um she still has her hair tie on. Come on through. That's how we get down over here. Come on in. Come on in. Come in the room. In the room. There's many. Oh, it's getting hot in here. Oh. The, the wind blew her uh, door shut. Come here. Come here and say hi. I did. Get your face in here. Hi. Mini me. They said, hey, Mini. Hi. Hey, Mini. Y'all, y'all see me glistening? It's getting hot. Mini is my daughter. She's my oldest daughter. And then I have another daughter. We call her Mini Mini Me. And so that's my oldest and my youngest is in the room. I doubt if she's going to come in here because she doesn't really do the camera thing too much. Every now and again, I can get her in here, but not all the time. So now, here's another box that I'm trying to think if there's something else that I haven't shown you guys. I'm trying to think. But anyway, this is another box. And I don't know. I was, look at this. This is from um, L'Oreal. They actually started a, um, and I don't know if you guys know, but L'Oreal owns a lot of things. Like L'Oreal owns uh, Urban Decay, I believe it is. They own, um, I think they even own Maybelline. They own like a lot of things, right? And so they started this website called We Love... We love dot makeup and they actually stream like a lot of my videos on there. So it's like a new website where they want you guys to, um, yeah, mini me is about to be 22 and my youngest is about to be 17. So yeah, yes, they own everybody. And so, um, they started this new website because what they wanted is they want to have a place where you can go to that one website. Cause you know how YouTube has like everything, right? From gaming, uh, channels to, vlog channels to yada 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 so this website we love dot makeup if somebody can type that on there that would be so bomb but um it's like we love dot makeup and you're, you're you're able to go there and see what makeup products are trending you're able to see more so um beauty videos like hair makeup skincare and stuff like that so yeah no nah, mini me is uh, -uh mini me is a grown woman she is about to be 22 
Thank you so much. Yes, we love dot makeup. That's what it is. I am well over 32. Let's say that. <laughs> yeah. Hey, that's them jeans. She get that from her mama. Hey. No, but anyway. So anyway, with all that said, a lot of this stuff, they just sent it to me in like a package. Some of the stuff is from um, other people too. Like Black Radiant sent me this palette, which I am so anxious to get into it. So don't mind me if it's a bunch of stuff in here, but most of it, motorcycle, okay. But most of it came from We Love Dot Makeup. Oh, and some stuff in here is from Pixie. That didn't come from We Love Dot Makeup. But anyway, this is, let me just show you the box because we talking. So it's, so what I was thinking of doing, ladies, is um, taking all of these products. I guess it could be the drugstore or whatever. I was thinking of just doing a, thank you. I was thinking of doing a get ready with me kind of like try on type haul. So hubby has been on my channel. He's been on, like I have some vlogs where he's in there. And yeah, I'll tell you one second. Remind me about the foundation question because I may forget. Thank you. But um, what was I saying? I was thinking of doing like a get ready with me try on with all this stuff. So if that's something that you guys want me to do, let me know and I will keep this in the box and I'll just, you know, the whole purpose for doing this video is so I can put some of this stuff up and I will do, um, I'm going to swatch. I am going to swatch the, um, the Too Faced, whoops, the Too Faced latex lipsticks. I'm going to swatch those on my arm though. So you guys can see that. Yeah, do it, do it, do it. So you guys want that? Hubby is not playing in no makeup. I, like, honestly, I tried to get him to do my makeup. And I, it's, I think he's kind of thinking about it. But then I don't know. We got to just see. I need y'all to pray, okay? Like, church, church, pray, church, pray. Okay, so that's what I want to do. So then I have this brush from Black, Black Radiance. And then I have a... And you guys know, It Cosmetics was purchased by L'Oreal too. And Too Faced was purchased by L'Oreal, I do believe. And so, you probably will, girl, because I'm all over the streets of LA. I'm not going to talk about my age on here, girl. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Just know that my oldest is about to be 22. So, you know, I didn't have her when I was 13. So, <laughs> yes. And so, then they have, they actually have a hair product in here, too, because L'Oreal owns, I guess they own Redken. And then, oh, I have another one of these. I may add this to a giveaway because I think I have one. And then they have liner in here. And then, oh, wait a minute. I don't know if if I just popped this Derma Blend in here or if it came with the package. I don't even know. But it's a makeup setting spray. Derma Blend has a setting spray. I'm getting Snapchat messages. I should have turned that stuff off. Be praying, girl. Be praying. And then... Okay, so I got some Rimmel stuff separate. I don't think that L'Oreal owns Rimmel, but I just popped everything together. Shampoo, and then, yeah, I put a whole bunch of stuff in here together. So it's some Rimmel stuff, but you do know, like I told you guys, L'Oreal does own Urban Decay. So this is their Hydra Charge Complexion Prep Priming Spray right here. And girl, this is Rimmel. And they sent me another one of these color correctors. I may do a giveaway on that. And then I told you they own Urban Decay again. So some lippies. And they sent over my favorite mascara, girl. You know how we do. And then Elf, I put some Elf in here too. Elf, I don't think Gloria owns them at all. But I put, I kind of got so much stuff that I just threw it all in this box because I needed to make room. There's so many. Thank you. It can, you primers and um, it does matter what type of primer you do, you use, but I'm gonna have to research that a little more and do a video on that. And then I got a liquid lipstick. I guess this, this is the Vice Urban Decay. And then um, I'm not gonna go through this whole thing, y'all, cause we will be here forever. But I got some more Bye Bye Pores powder from It Cosmetics. And just a bunch of stuff, as you guys can see. And then this other company, it's called, um, 
No, I had, this is not a mood ring as far as I know, but I don't know where I got this from. I had this thing for years, y'all. But this choker, I don't know if you guys know, but I do sell jewelry now because, hey, you might as well join them if, if you love it, right? And so my website is ckjewels.com, but the best way to shop for the jewelry on my site is to shop new releases and to shop blockbusters because that's where all the hot items are. But everything on my website is $5, y'all. $5 foot long. No, I'm just kidding. But everything is $5 and it's the bomb. Like all the jewelry you guys see me rocking like over the last couple months, it has been from my site. And I have an Instagram page now is Seeky Jewels so that I can like all the new releases, I just post them there. And if you guys have purchased, which I see some of y'all purchasing and I love you and I appreciate you girl. But um, if you guys purchase and you post a picture on Instagram, tag me at C Key Jewels for a chance to be featured on the site or on the Instagram uh, page because I want to start promoting you guys. I want to share. I did what with my mom? So, yeah. Yes, thank you so much, Kyla. Is that how you say your name, Kyla? Oh, it's almost like Kayla. So yeah, so it's always in the description box because I'm really happy about that, you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm just like, I, did y'all see how excited I got? Like, I'm so happy about it because I told y'all on Snapchat, if you follow me, Seeky is building an empire. Y'all just watch, y'all just watch. Y'all gonna be like, dang, whoa, 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 watch, watch, it's coming. Um, I have not, but I do have the Velvetizer. I'm going to try it because I'm hearing that with the Velvetizer, you can mix it in with the foundation. So um, I'm going to try that. But the foundation I have on today is Estee Lauder Double Wear. And it's a mixture of sandalwood and rich caramel and caramel caramel, whatever, you know, whatever floats your boat. I always do giveaways, but the thing about it, so if you follow me, then you know, that's how you know about the giveaways. Like I don't just, you know what I mean? They they just come. They're just like sporadic. They just come. I don't like do this big old announcement of it. They just kind of I just hit you with it. And so, um, am I bringing out a makeup line? A if the Lord say the same. I'm not gonna go into details. I'm not gonna go into more details. But I wanted to show you this too because I've never tried it. But if you guys are interested in me putting this baby, let me put this down. If you guys are interested, this hair smells so good. It smells so clean, so fresh and so clean. And wait, and then it's a makeup bag too. You would, aw, thank you. I'm all about, I'm all about makeup that looks natural, flawless and natural. You get what I'm saying? Like I, I, I can appreciate people that can chisel and contour the mess out of their face. That's all good. But I like makeup for that everyday woman. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, but anyway, so let me know if you want me to try this. This is some new product from a company called, I don't even know, Alili, Alilai, Alilai, I don't know, but it's, let me put it up here. There you go. And it is a 3D silicone sponge. And this is what it looks like. It feels a little sticky, but it's, it's weird. It's like silicone. It's kind of like the, um, what was that thing that they called when I did a video on it too. It was like a bra insert, but it's something like that, but it's shaped in the form of a beauty blender and it feels a little sticky, but it's not. And so I'm thinking about doing a video on that too. I, excuse me. Yeah, I already talked about the lippy. I got somebody already. Thank you. But I got somebody. We will be blocking. No worries. No worries. Thank you. And so, yeah, it's something like the Silly Sponge, but there are three of them in there. So, yeah. So, anyway, there's something else I want to show you guys, too. Hey, welcome to the Fam Bam. Welcome to the Fam Bam. I'm trying to read your comments and go on. So, then also, oh, the Gym Blender. Okay, so also, ColourPop came out with some nail polishes, y'all. I was like, what? I don't know how much they are yet because I literally just got it the other day and I totally played in them. That is what is on my nails now. I have on, let me get it right for y'all be like, that's not right. This one is called Pixelated. And when I say that the formula is really thick, I, I think that they could have done better with the brush though because I feel like I struggled a little bit with the brush. And you guys, I do also have, I just did my whole nail routine video. So that is like, it's like a couple of videos back. 
Mini Me is chilling. Mini Me is in her room. She has to get ready to go to work. So she's she's not trying to come on here today. Thank you. So this is uh oh. Oh, I thought I heard her coming back. So this one is pixelated. And then, oh my gosh, well, like this hand is struggling this week. A lot of my nails broke, but this one is beautiful still. Okay. So on this nail right here, you guys can't even see the sparkle, but it is so bomb. It is called One Wish, Two Wish. And this is what it is. It is like a, um, I don't even know how I would describe it, but it is so bomb. And yeah, many me already came in here for a minute. No, it's not pixelated like that. It is like pixelated like pixie and then laid it. So there you go. I don't even know if y'all can see that because I'm on my phone. I'm not on like my camera. So yeah. And then this one is one wish, two wish. And then they have four more, which I'm going to share, but they're really big. Like you get a whole lot in them. So this one is called, I wand it that way. And so it's like, honestly, this one right here, Hey. Oh, see, Minnie Me hear me talking about her, so she coming back. Yes, ma'am. That's not. Yes. You need to be daddy and moderator. He already knows. Tell him. I already did. You can't do it no more. I don't know why. So anyway, so here is this right here. Here's this one. And I thought that it was just going to be like something that I could put over the colors. But it's it's much more than that. You could wear it by itself. Matter of fact, next time I do my nails, I'm going to do this all by itself. Because it's just that bomb. And this one, I told you, is I want it that way. It's kind of like crystal-like. Oh, does it really? It's really good, but I just I would I just wish the brush was a little different. But it's so thick, like literally, I could have used one coat. But because I'm a two coat type of girl, I do two. But I think you could do one with this. This one is Dust a Dream, and honestly, I think this is like unicorn like themed. Seriously, because the names of it and the colors, they're like all pastel. I have not I have not tried the Renaissance palette, but I have tried some of um, ABH products already. I get that Yolanda Adam thing a lot. A lot of people say that. Now this one is called First Wings First. You see the whole unicorn theme situation? And then they have Be Fairy Afraid. And that's it. And I don't know how much they are, but usually ColourPop is like, I don't know, uh, five to six dollars or something like that. So I don't know. I'll we'll put the link to that in the description box as well. But let's get into this Too Faced thing. So Too Faced, that big, the big palette that you, okay, six dollars. That big picture that you guys saw as my thumbnail dang say it don't spray right but that big thumbnail picture you guys saw um this was in that Too Faced pal or that Too Faced box this is a glitter palette that they came out with and they also came with a glitter base it has a glitter base in there and this is what the glitter palette looks like it's supposed to be all glitter y'all so it has oh this is kind of like unicorn too it has um fairy dust names like fairy dust confetti um hot darn i ain't about to say that word but then it says glitter goes rose all day work it work it and oh it's on and then splash and then it has a brightening base it says and then it has a intensifying base right there i don't know i'm about to swatch it right now we're gonna see because i i don't know let's try it together i'm gonna do work it work it that's what it looks like and hold on I don't want to look all, wait. Look at that. It doesn't really look like, I guess it is glittery, but it kind of looks like a foiled shadow with a bunch of glitter. And there's still some on my finger. That's cute. Let's see. Oh, it's on. There's that one. And let's see right here. Look at that. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's, uh oh, what's going on, on my computer? That's gorgeous, look at that. And then I'm gonna do two more since I have two more fingers right here. Ooh, easy, easy, easy. Brush swatches, I'm not doing all that because this, like, this is how I swatch it and then when I do a video trying it on, that's how we do it. Cause to be honest with you, I could do brush swatches on my hand. I could do hand swat finger swatches. It's all about how you apply it on your eyes. So it's still going to be different. So I, I, I don't know why people get all like deep on that, like brush swatches, hand swatches. It's like, just swatch it to see what the color is like and then play with it on your eye and see if you like it. That's how I like to do it. I like to do it on my eye. After I show you the hand swatches, I literally just do hand swatches to show you guys the color. 
color. You know what I mean? Not to say, oh, this is the bomb. Oh, this works great. I don't, Cause I don't know yet. I won't know until I put it on. Okay. And there you go. This is, um, this is splash right here. Nope. I have a skincare regimen that that's, that's all I do. I don't do all that extra stuff. Um, I may do one. Like I may put this in the whole get ready with me video. Let me get my paper towels real quick. And let me see what's going on with my moderator situation. Hold on a second, y'all. Hold on a second. Hold on. That's the thing about these um these live videos. Y'all get to see everything. Yeah, I'm pretty impressed. I mean, I haven't tried it yet, but I'll let y'all I'll let y'all just take a look see at that right now. Hold on. Hold on. One second. Oops. Hold on, you guys. You need some tips for, huh? Wait a second. Babe. Okay. Yeah, mermaid like colors. And since I wiped it off my fingers, let's do some more. Babe! I'm calling my husband. Come here! So this one is the hot darn. That ain't really the name to say something else, but I'm not saying that. But there you go. Isn't that cute? They're kind of pastel. <gasps> glitter goes. Hold on. Let's watch that. That's glitter goes. I don't know where I'm going to put it. Look it, that's so cute, girl. Okay, now, a friend of mine actually sells Mary Kay. Hold on, let me get it. Don't be laughing at my PJ pants. That's how YouTubers do it. They dress from the top, <laughs> from the waist up. <laughs> so, uh, thank you. Yeah, Glitter Girls looks good. So, my friend sells Mary Kay. I don't know... Like what her name is? Can you fix it? Here. No, just... This is my hubby. Hold on. I'm not coming on camera, but... Give it to you. He's not coming on camera. Hold on a second. <laughs> Here. And then you just say that. Hubby about to get it. Uh-oh, yeah, babe. Somebody just came in acting crazy. Okay, so this is like, I don't know what my friend's site is or how you guys can buy it from her, but I'll try to figure it out. But she said this stuff is the truth. It's eye makeup remover, but she remo she uses it to remove everything. So I'm about to use this to remove my um, these swatches. And then we're going to go to the hand swatches of the lipstick. Nah, I told you. Hubby, oh. It just really just kind of wiped it away real good. But, oh God, it left a bunch of glitter behind though. Now I'm sparkling. Y'all see that? I'm sparkling. Um, I that's a that's a I can, that's a broad question. You have the glitter palette or you have this makeup remover? I'm not gonna be using this on my face because I don't I don't you guys know when I remove my makeup, I only use grapeseed oil. So this is literally just to remove swatches and, and stuff like that. I don't like maybe when the summertime comes, I'll use like a little highlighter, you know, in this region or something like that or on my shoulder or something like that. But that's it. Dang, y'all. This glitter is like everywhere, girl. It's everywhere. OK, Lancome eye makeup remover. No, I don't use um, I don't use makeup remover like that. She gave it to me, so I wanted to try it out. So let's get these lippies and go in. Here, I think it's like 20 of them. So here's some, one fell. I hope I have more, one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Maybe it's 15. Oh, it's 14 of them, it's 14 of them. And one of them is a lip gloss, y'all. Look at that, it's clear, girl, it's clear. Hey, from Atlanta. Oh, 
Okay. Woo, girl. All right, here we go. I'm going to do hand swatches. I am not about to put these on my lips because I'm kind of feeling my lippy right now. Am I? Are we right? Let me see. Can y'all see me good or do I need to come up? There we go. Because I'm on my phone. Too Faced. It's Too Faced, the stuff I just showed. Lippies, hey, look at this. Look at these colors. And then I think after I show y'all this, oh, real quick, real quick. I have a giveaway. Um, I'm gonna, well, the giveaway for this one is already closed. The Makeup Geek, the In The New Collection, I did a video on it. I'm gonna be, if you did enter it, it's closed now, but if you did enter it, the new collection, I'm gonna be announcing the winner probably today. Today or tomorrow. I'm gonna try to do it when I'm done with this. And then also I have a giveaway of the um, Ofra Beverly Hills. I did a Snapchat takeover with Ofra. So y'all show Ofra some love there, thebomb.com. So I did a Snapchat takeover with Ofra and they, um, I, I did a giveaway on there and someone didn't claim their Beverly Hills highlighter because this is what I was giving away. So that is still open on Twitter. So follow me on Twitter, Seeky Beauty and the rules on the rules are on twitter for how to win this and i'm going to be announcing that today so you want to do that before the day's over and oh don't you burn that food girl do not burn that food <laughs> yes ulta is i mean ofra is at ulta now but i don't think the discount code applies i'm not sure how much over is at ulta now but i do know that if you buy it on their website and you use my code ck you get 30 percent off so always remember that so yes if you do it with ulta you could just go into ulta and purchase it but i don't think that the discount code applies but these are the lippies and we are about to swatch these babies on my arm and not on the lips maybe with Minnie if she has time yeah they're in ulta mac is in ulta now Ofra is in Ulta now. There's another, um, there's someone else who is in Ulta now, but I cannot remember who it is. Yes, thank you so much. And you get 30% off. Yes, I do. Um, it is an affiliate link. And so, yes, I do get commission off of it. But I mean, why not? I'm just saying. You get what I mean? What lipstick? I already talked about that. The code is CK, just like my name. C-K-E-Y. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think you can... I don't think that Ulta honors that, but definitely ask. And if, and Faith, if you can let me know, then I'll definitely spread the word. So yeah, thank you so much. I have, yes, it's pretty, my skincare is pretty much the same. Entrepreneur, yes, girl. It's, a, when I tell y'all it is about to go down, I just need y'all to stay tuned, be a part of the family so that you can just come on this journey with me because it's going to be a great journey. And I'm, I'm really, really excited about the things that God is doing and that he's going to do. And I'm kind of overwhelmed or not overwhelmed in a bad way, but like just, it's just amazing if that's the way I can put it. So anyway, I need to get some WD-40 in this year. Um, Napa Valley, if you check my skincare playlist, you'll see everything that I use on my face. And in every video that I talk about the stuff that I'm using, it is all on in the description box. I see you saying let's go, but listen, I got on live so I could talk to y'all. So that's, that's, I want to talk and play, talk and play. Yes. So let me know. Let me know. So anyway, I don't know what that was, but okay. So here we go. I like this. This is pretty cool. The clear one. I mean, I don't really need to say much about it, but it's not like you guys know how I use that Maybelline shine shot. Um, it's not as juicy as the Maybelline, but it's, I mean, I'm not gonna swatch it cause it's clear. You know what I mean? And I should be looking that way, but it's really cool. Like it's, I've been wearing it a few times and it's a little moisturizing, but it's nothing like aquaphor. Thank you. So let's go with this one. This color right here is Strange Love. Well, hey, you got your groove back, girl. Welcome to the fam bam. I don't know how these swatches are going to be. So do not judge. Do not judge. I think I need to look at it first. Oh, my God. All this glitter is still on my hand. This one is... Why I didn't try this? That's close to my skin tone. <gasps> I did not try this the other day. This is called Strange Love. That is, that looks like it'll be a great, cool nude for me. Ah, girl. Yes, my first wig. N talk and play. I don't even remember what I said. But this is another new one. This one is called Peekaboo. That is a nice nude. I'm gonna have to play with that. 
So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. And I think Instagram and Snapchat are the most that I'm on where you get, like I do the Instagram stories, I post pictures and stuff like that. And we just have fun. You know what I mean? Especially Snapchat, especially. But this one is Peekaboo. Peekaboo, girl. Look at that. I'm going to try, I'm going to try, I'm going to try to do lip swatches with Minnie if her time, if her schedule permits. If not, I'll just do, if you guys still want a lip swatch, I'll just do a, like a little voiceover lip swatch like I always do. Yes. Yes, yes. Is it sticky? Um, I have not tried the lippies yet, but I know that the lip gloss is not really sticky. And so this one right here is called, hold on, my Hopeless Romantic. Yeah, Peekaboo is going to have to be an ombre because that's pretty bright. I tried on a couple of them one night. I haven't worn them, but the day I got them, I tried on a couple, but I don't remember which one it was. I think it was this one, and it's not, like, I would definitely have to use a liner. And I like, I'm hoping that because it says latex, they do have that glossy look, but I don't know yet. And I'm not about to take off my little nibble because, you know, I'm feeling myself right now. But this one is called Hopeless Romantic right there. It looks similar to, it's similar to Peekaboo, but it has a little more, um, has a little more of a peach to it, but I don't think you can really tell with the lighting. So that is that. What you say, girl? What you say? I'm trying to go from light to dark, but I can't make no promises. It is the bomb. Also, y'all, I did a Morphe um, Snapchat takeover too, and I was inside the Morphe store, and I showed you guys me getting another nibble because I had to get it back up. This one is called Love You Mean It. <laughs> Ain't that cute love you me the names on these glosses are bomb or these latex lippies whatever you want to call them but this is called i'm putting a little bit more so that you guys can really see it but these kind of remind me of glosses like very pigmented glosses but i don't know i haven't really tried it but love you mean it right there that is so cute Too Faced knows how to do packaging they know how to name their stuff and they know how to do products, quite frankly. And then, yes, yes, yes. Yes, I already swatched it. So you will be able to play it back. I'm going to leave it on my channel so you can play it back. Yeah. Aw, thank you for the love. This one is called, what? Girl, hold on. I'm telling you, companies, they put stuff like so small. I think this says safe word. Safe word? I don't really know. Safe word? It could just be me struggling to read that. Y'all know I'm serious about names of products. If it has crazy names that I don't agree with, I don't wear it. Y'all know that. So if y'all don't see me wear a whole bunch of different like makeup brands, maybe the name ain't right for me. So I'm very, very serious about that. I really don't. I don't. Yeah. I don't play with that. Ooh, don't you get in trouble at work, girl. So safe word right here. There you go. And after this, I think I'm going to wrap it up. Also, I have a Fashion Nova video coming. I'm sharing with y'all some of the stuff I got from Fashion Nova, so stay tuned for that. Yeah, I don't wear crazy names because I take names serious. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, you know that I'm serious about words, like serious. Oh, I don't know. I don't even know what safe word means. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I don't have the heat palette, so I don't know. This one is called Love You A Long Time. She Love You A Long Time. That's that's a song from old school, so I don't know if y'all know that. Me Love You A Long Time. So this one is called Love You Long... I'm in love with Fashion Nova. I'm just going to say that. Like, y'all will see in the video. So anyway, Love You Long Time right here. That's really, really cute. I think they did, and it's not the greatest song. So I just thought about that. I was like, oh, that's not so good. <laughs> Thank you. This is the eyebrow um, gel from Ofra that I'm addicted to that I talked about on their, um, I talked about it on their Snapchat, and I talked about it on Snapchat, all, on my Snapchat all the time. It's this gel, like I don't have to mix it with nothing. It's bomb.com. Now this is called Twilight Zone. I'm kind of like, mm, okay, okay, Twilight Zone. I like, I feel some kind of way, but it's not horrible, like the name. So that is Twilight Zone. It is like a pastel purple. So why don't I do this and show you guys as well? 
You're definitely, do you guys remember the um, Viva Glam Nikki when MAC did a collaboration with Nicki Minaj? This is what this color reminds me of. So you most definitely need a liner. I look like, I just said Nicki Minaj and you would say that, that's funny. But yeah, I do, okay. Yeah, get, Jackie, you better preach. Okay, and so the next color right here is rated R. Ooh, 17 or under, you can't wear this. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, so it looks like the swatches have now moved to the arm, but we're it's okay, it's okay. It's all right, it's all right. I want y'all to follow me on Snap because we have fun and y'all see me without my wig and like it's uncut, it's raw. And then we, we having our little singing sessions too. So it's really fun. All right, so here we go. This one is called Rated R, like I said. Look at that, girl. That is cute. That Talk about summary. And you guys, I will have, check this out. I have an upcoming collaboration with Iman Cosmetics. Woo, 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 woo. And it is going to be a beach summer look. So I'm super excited. So stay tuned, you guys. Iman Cosmetics. What? What? I'm excited. And then let's go to this next color. This is, um, but first, lipstick. Thank you. And I also shared some news on, um, I shared this on my Snapchat. And y'all don't mind me, we get into the swatches, but when I'm, you know, while we here and in person and we talking and, you know, I can communicate with you guys, I wanna tell you guys all the good stuff. So um, I'm actually, I've been brought on, um, or I'm now a team member, I guess, with Online Makeup Academy. Do you guys remember when I did a collaboration with them where they sent me the, um, they sent me the makeup kit and they allowed me to go through the class and I did all the homework and I did everything that I was supposed to do for the class. I literally, I don't know, I guess you do it at your own pace, but I finished the class in like two weeks. I got my makeup certification, so I'm now a certified makeup artist. Well, they actually brought me on board to do makeup on women of color because one thing that I told them in the video, you guys can check the video too, Excuse me. But one thing I said in the video, which y'all know, integrity is how we roll. And I was completely honest. And I said that, excuse me, I said that the class was awesome, but I felt like they needed to cater to women of color more. I felt like they needed to, um, to, you know what I mean? Have more, cause I felt like when I took the classes and I saw some of the tutorials and they were basically teaching us how to do makeup, I saw that they did not have like women of color or women that look like me or even women that were like a shade above me so i told them that and they were like you want to be a part of the team do you want to come on as a makeup instructor so i will be doing that i will be you know some of my stuff will show on their curriculum so i'm excited about that so i told you guys it's about to go down y'all it's about to go down it's okay i'm not worried about that because we having fun we're not worried about people thumbs and down we having a good old time so this one right here i told you guys is but first lipstick you know how you say, but first coffee is but first lipstick. I just, I can't wait to share with you guys as things just go down. You know what I mean? Because it's just, it's, it's, it's awesome. God is awesome. But that's but first lipstick right there. These colors are, they look pretty glossy, right? It's kind It does have like a latex feel to it. You know what I mean? So I'm hoping that it doesn't move and it lasts long. I don't know. I haven't worn them yet, but... Girl, it's getting hot. <laughs> it's getting hot, and this is called Hot Mama. Hey, I'm glistening. Do y'all see that? It kind of has a little dewy look, but I'm starting to like the dewy look. I can't believe I said that, but I'm starting to like it a little bit. But this is called Hot Mama. The represent, I'm, cause listen, we have to represent because I have a picture on Instagram where I was rocking this shirt. This shirt said black beauty matters. I thought that was so cute. Black radiant sent it to me. So check out my Instagram to see that. That I thought that was really, really cute because you know, we love stuff too. You know what I mean? I'm glowing. I'm glowing or I'm sweating. Wh which one? No, I'm just kidding. Like I'm, I'm glistening everywhere, but I don't mind it. It's not too bad. It's good. So anyway, this is hot mama right here. There you go, right there, girl. Absolutely, like we gotta represent, you know what I mean? I'm glowing, okay, just as long as I ain't looking like a grease monkey, we all good. He is all the time and all the time, God is good. Okay, now this color is called, uh-oh, I'm bossy, that's what it's called. 
<gasps> oh, don't you say 120 degrees. Lord have mercy. Lord, be a AC, be a breeze, send a breeze. Hold on, you'll be able to see the last one when I show you this. This one is called I'm Bossy. And, and I guess it's a, it's a, it's true to his name because it's pretty bold. That's called I'm Bossy right there. And I'm trying to move it around so y'all can see. It really does have like a shine to it. That is bomb, right? Especially for the summertime. Hey from Houston. These are Too Faced. And so then I think I'll go in with this one. And then after this, I'm going to wrap it up because it looks like we've been on here almost an hour, girl. But time flies when you're having fun. This is Bye, Felicia. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. <laughs> that is adorbs. That, ooh, that is pretty. Dang, this makes me want to take off this lipstick I got on right now. I do not have to swatch it 50 times, but I don't know why I always do that. So look at that. This is by Felicia. Thank you. Look at that. I'm trying to show you guys their true color. My swatches are getting a little crazy, but it's like my light is right there too. Woo, hold on. Hawaii, oh hey, I wanna come to Hawaii. Yes, love a good purple lippy. Now this one is called, can't touch this. Dun, 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 dun. Can't touch this. <laughs> That it, two face, you just too, two face, you too cute, too cute. They aren't they cute? Oh my gosh! Yes, hey from Connecticut. I don't like I said. I just feel like I gotta swatch three times. I don't know why. I don't really have to swatch that much, but. It's just in my DNA. I just, I don't know. Maybe it's just like therapeutic or something. I don't know. But anyway, uh-oh, I'm, I'm tripping. That's can't touch this. Mm -mm 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 right there. But it's so daggone glossy looking. I'm trying to show you, but the lighting, these colors are bomb. And it really gets real once you get right from here and down. They are really gorgeous. They did their thing. I don't know. I didn't even, I can't catch all the comments. Oh, platinum is my girl. Dramatic lip colors. And this is the last one. <gasps> this kind of looks like what I have on right now, girl. Ooh, I think I'm gonna like this one. Uh oh, this is called Bite Me. Hey, mini, mini. <clears throat> I mean, not mini, mini. Hey, mini, me. Mini, mini is my youngest child. I just saw her pop up, y'all. Mini Me still doesn't want to be on your channel for swatches. Mini, Mini, Mini Me, she's like her dad, you guys. She doesn't really like being on um, social media that much. She's She has her moments, so I got to get her when the getting is good. And my husband, too. He's on my Snapchat from yesterday, so if y'all want to see it, you got to go check that out before it's over. I guess it'll be over at, like, I don't know, 7 o'clock or something like that. I don't know what the price of these are because I literally just got these the other day. And so this one is called Bite Me. That's just, that's just, yeah. Aw, okay, so this is the, oh, this does look like what I have on, but it, I think I want to put this on top because it looks like what I have on. It looks like what I have on, but it's kind of glossy. I may put this on top right now. That one right there is called Bite Me. This is Too Faced, guys. This is Too Faced. Yes. I'm going to try this. Let me take this sticker off this mirror. Oh, it's not even a sticker. All right, let's try this and see how they actually look. This is the only, it looks just like what I have on. Ah, girl. Mm, they have a smell to it. It's not like the best smell ever. It doesn't, I thought it would be like candy or something. You better, oh, look at that. You better. You better. Mm, that's good. Oh, they're 21? I don't even know. That's about right, though, because I think that they're... Um, I have to keep going in because I have this matte lipstick on. But that's about right because I think that's how much their other ones were. Hold on. 
Girl, when I'm putting on lipstick, we performing an operation. We got to pay attention. We got to, we got to be careful. Mm, see? See? I wonder if these get on your teeth a lot. I don't know. Hey, what's up, good people? Let me see. Oh, uh, yeah, it does feel a little sticky. But I guess sticky is not always a bad thing because when you have a little bit of stickiness, that means it's going to last. Yes, this one is bomb. It, it looks just like, it looks like a glossy nibble. That didn't sound too right. Yeah, I think you're going to have to do the finger trick when you wear these because they're going to get everywhere on your on your teeth. They're sticky. Mm-hmm. They're sticky. Hair deets are coming soon. I will probably put it in the description box after I do this video, after, you know, after I'm done. And then um, I have a dedicated video coming. Dedicated video coming for y'all. But, ooh, it's getting hot. But look at this. You can't, can't tell me nothing. Don't worry about nothing. Just kidding. That is cute. Literally, I just filmed a video on this hair. This is my very, very first time wearing it. So yeah, I'm gonna tell you right now, I love my first wig. They are perfect for people like me because you do not have to pluck. I didn't have to pluck a thing, which I don't pluck it anyway, Minimi does. She's the one that is like anointed in the wig slayage, okay? I'm not. I just, I just, she hooks them up for me and I put them on. But literally, I just flat, I put it on, flat ironed it. Of course, I had to cut the lace. What would be so perfect is if they would do the lace for you already, but you know, I mean, come on. So that's, that's what it looks like. And I don't have any concealer. I don't have any, I, well, I put a little shadow like right there, but this is like kind of straight out the box. Smells good. Smells fresh, but I am going to show you, um, my video is actually going to be showing you this one, which I've worn it like 50,000 times already. And I love it. I absolutely love it. And it's going to be me putting on this one. Now, hold on. I feel I don't know if they're uh, moisturizing at all this lipstick because I had on a matte lipstick underneath. So I will be telling a story if I say yeah. But I'm going to tell you right now, I think that you have to do like, I think you got to do that trick because it keeps getting on my lip, on me, on my teeth. So I feel like you need to do that. But yeah, I don't know that I will wear a matte underneath it like that because Together, I feel like I got a whole lot going on. So, you know, just stay tuned. Uh-oh, it stains though, look. I was trying to wipe that off, it stains. So anyway, stay tuned on Snapchat and you guys will get all the details and all the goods and stuff like that. But there's the colors and I'm about to wrap this thing up because it's been like a good hour. Unless you guys have anything you want to ask, ask away because that's why I do these live videos because I want to show you guys stuff as well as chat. And now I can put away all this stuff because I opened it. A A A. Yes, girl, Jackie be slaying her wig. She even glues them down and stuff. I don't do all that. I'm I'm simple when it comes to wig. We don't do all that. We've been on here for an hour, Tawana or Tawan. That's my girl. She be she she definitely shows her support. Hey, girl. Hey. Thank you for the love. So, oh. You guys see they are they are kind of sticky when I just wipe that off. Like watch this. I'll show you like this. They they kind of stay like they are very firm. It's very firm. Hey. No, you didn't miss it. You didn't miss it because I'm going to leave it on my channel. So no worries. Ooh, they are. I think they will be lasting. Cuz look at that. That is I got to really get that off, girl. Oh, thank you so much for the love. Y'all know that the love is mutual. Y'all know the love is mutual. I'm going to tell you right now, do not, do not put a matte lipstick underneath this. Because I don't like the way it feels with the matte. Because the matte was already matte, you feel me? You know what? Um, I'm not going to talk about my age. I just really, just, just do, just think about it. Like my oldest is about to be 22. But um, as far as vegan makeup, I can honestly say it doesn't really matter to me. So I don't really check ingredients and say, oh, well, does this have that or this have that? I really don't. 
so I couldn't really tell you. I mean, I've heard that Beauty Bakery makeup is, is um, vegan, I think, but I don't know. I don't even know. I have a video on my channel that's, it, I think it says YouTuber tag or something like that. So that, that in that video, I give you like tips and how I kind of started and stuff like that. And, you know, different people that helped me and different things I did to kind of grow my channel and stuff like that. So check that video out. And I have a bunch of foundation reviews on my channel that you can check out as far as knowing what's good for the summer. Yes, I have a 20. Well, she's going to be 22 and then my youngest is going to be 17. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm definitely proud, but I just don't go. I just don't go like, you know, telling my age everywhere, but I'm definitely proud because God is good and he's a keeper. Um, I already showed the Mac box of PR and there's really nothing to review because they're all their old lippies. So I already have lip swatches on a lot of their lipsticks. So it's really nothing to review. It's just some of their, some of their famous, uh, shades. I already talked about it, but I am wearing the Estee Lauder double wear foundation, which I'm going to do a review on that soon because y'all, y'all not going to believe what I tell you when I do that review. Y'all not going to believe it. Y'all going to be like, say what, what you say? Yes, someone just said the whole Nicki Minaj situation, but I don't think so. But okay, she cute. Um, I don't have any Illamasqua products. If I do, I don't even know I have them. The Iman Foundation review is already up on my channel. This is going to be an Iman uh, collaboration. I'm going to be doing a beach look. Yes, this is double wear. This is um, uh, Sandalwood and Rich Caramel. No, I don't think they're getting rid of their old lippies, but I don't work for Mac, so I'm not sure. But I hope not because, girl, that's, um, what am I trying to say? That is like a classic. They can't be getting rid of that. But I will say that I love liquid lipsticks way more than, um, than the tube lipsticks nowadays. Laura Mercier Foundation, I do not have it. Um, concealer, you are in luck because I just did a video on my top 10 concealers. So check that video out. Matter of fact, um, if I can remember, I will add links to these videos in the, in the back. Um, you mean the Kim Kardashian makeup that just launched? Um, I don't know. I don't have it. BB cream. I guess my favorite BB cream would be, um, hold on. Y'all for real. Let me see if this is getting on my teeth. Um, I do still use CoverGirl Queen, but I use it all. BB cream would be the, um, it's called Ruby Kisses. Gosh, I can't, I have a review on it, but I can't remember the name right now. Hey, Oklahoma, and thank you for the love. And yes, I still love the CoverGirl Queen foundation, but I used it all, which it was in my empties video. So I just, you know, I haven't bought any more because I have all these other foundations. So they're really, I have probably, I, I can count on both hands some of my favorite foundations. So let me check these teeth because I feel like this is getting everywhere. This is bomb, but it is a little sticky. Oh, it's okay. You can go back and watch it. There you go, girl. There you go. Kiss New York Aqua BB Cream. That's the one. The shade I'm in is a little iffy because I used to be medium, but now it seems like it's a little too red, but that is bomb. $7.99 at your local beauty supply. Um, It's the bomb. Retro mattes. Love, 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 love. I have never tried ABH concealer. I think I had their contour palette and I used to use it for contour, but I never really used it for highlights. So I don't know. Girl, that Revlon Colorstay video, that is so old, but Revlon Colorstay, Revlon Colorstay, and I'm gonna just talk to y'all a few more minutes and then I'm gonna head out cause like we're having a good time. But the Revlon Colorstay, that is an oldie but goodie. And I used to use that in my makeup kit when I first started doing makeup for real, like seriously. Um, I do want to do a meetup very soon. It will probably be in the form of like an event. And I'm also going to start doing like um, makeup classes and stuff like that. So I, I will keep you guys posted. But the best way to stay tuned is Snapchat and Instagram. I'm telling you, that is where I can just hop on and update you on everything versus coming on here and doing like a whole video. And I don't want to do a live stream every week. You know what I mean? Oh, how I would love to come to Florida. The shade I use from Lancome in their Tanti Doll is 470. And I love their powder. If you guys have not tried their um their powder, I think it's called their dual wear or dual something, dual matte something. It is so bomb. Um, would you guys like live makeup classes? Let me know and I'll try to get something together. I mean, I ha I don't, but that could be that could. 
ABH concealer. I haven't used it. Is that yes to the to the makeup live makeup classes? Cause I y'all, I have so many plans. I need to write all this stuff down. Yes, for real, y'all would do that. Okay, so let me ask you this. How much would you guys be willing to pay for a live makeup class? Tell me. I want your feedback because, you know, you guys know when I do videos, I love doing videos from a consumer standpoint as well because I am a consumer. So I want to know your thoughts. Like, how much would you be willing to pay for um, a live makeup class? I'm thinking, I guess, well, let's have some feedback. Like, when, when we say live makeup class, like, how long? Like, an hour maybe? Let me know, like what, like, you know, let me know. Give me some ideas. Even when this video is over, feel free to put it in the comments because the one thing that sucks about these live streams is that all these comments go away. 50 for an hour? That's pretty cheap. A 50 for an hour? That's pretty cheap. 75 seems, mm, you know, mm, seems... Depending on the time and the content. If I did a live makeup class, what would you guys want to see? Like, um, are you talking like beginners? Is it, a, is it a specific thing that you want me to tap into? Like what? You don't? It's all good. Nikki's cute though. She cute. I've seen so many, and this is no shade to people that do classes for like $500 and stuff like that. But really, if you're just, if you are a, um, just a person that wants to up your makeup skills and you're not trying to do makeup artistry, um, 500 is a whole lot. So I definitely want to come in doing something affordable that, you know, that people can, you know, that, that people that are not all the way into makeup wouldn't mind paying. Cause I'm gonna tell you right now, if you'd have hit me up like maybe 10 years ago when I wasn't, no, not 10, maybe like, I don't know, eight, nine years ago when I wasn't really into makeup and you told me it was a makeup class for $500, I'd be like, you done lost your mind. So, and that's only because I wasn't into makeup, but now I would spend that because I know that I am investing in myself. But if you're just a beginner and you're not really trying to do the artistry, then that could be pretty pricey. Under eye creasing, I already have a video on that. And honestly, if y'all know that I love to keep it all the way real, there's nothing, as far as I know, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but there's nothing that's going to stop completely your under eye creasing. Because if you have lines under your eyes, the more you smile and squint and frown and do all the stuff that you do, stuff goes in those lines, just like laugh lines. It's just a matter of time. Y'all know, I be talking like I keep it all the way 100. Like it's only, I like to use products that stop me from creasing like for as long as I can or how, how can I say that um where I get less creasing in a certain amount of time did I say that right I don't know but I, I ultimately get creasing anyway no matter what concealer I use but it's like the it's the matter of time in which I start to crease which makes a concealer good for me so the Estee Lauder double wear I have on right now that stuff is the real deal holy feel it is so bomb. When you put it on, it does not move. It's one of those things that um, you don't want to really let that concealer sit and then try to blend it out because it definitely stays in place. It's definitely stay all day. I miss that. Live, okay. See, yep, I got you. I got you. You're not a um, MUA. And that's a lot of people want to know, you know, basically how to enhance their makeup skills, right? That's pretty much what people want. Girl, it's getting hot. I think it's about time to, to wrap this up. But if there, I'll take a couple more questions and then I'm gonna just like, um, cause this light is really, really hot and it's getting hot and I'm like, girl. So if there's any more, I'll answer a couple and then I'm gonna head on out. Yeah, creasing, laugh lines, you, I'm sorry. You're not, you're not gonna, unless you get Botox, it's probably still gonna happen. So I have, um, I have a playlist on my channel that's called Protective Styles and Natural Hair. So you will see different wig reviews as well as in whenever I rock a unit in a video, always check the description box, y'all. Because when I say that I fill that thing out, like um, take advantage of it because I spend a lot of time completing the description box so that you guys can have all the answers to your questions. Absolutely. I love talking to you guys. So when you say a tutorial on fixing makeup, that's really broad. You got to be a little more specific. I want to travel to Atlanta. I want to travel around the world, like talking to y'all, like doing seminars and stuff like that. Let's just put that on out there in the atmosphere. Okay. 
Okay, I don't, I can't, I need to go, I need to check my email to do that. I gotta check it. Don't be scared. See, this is the thing. I get a lot of people that are scared to try makeup. Makeup is, is fun and it washes off. So don't be scared. If you mess up, girl, like, you know, the little engine that could, you know, keep going, keep going until you get it right. The duration of time. That's cool, too. That's cool, too. Yeah. And I think you're talking about the concealer. You want to go for it. Don't wait. Go for it. So um, when you say which products hold for a little while, that's a really broad question. That's hard to answer because I don't know what you're talking about. But I will say check out my favorites video because in my favorites videos, that's where I talk about um, the products that I love or, you know, cause it changes. Cause we try new products all the time. Right. So we try new products and I get to loving those. So the favorites videos are a great, are great videos to start with, to find out what types of makeup products are great. Okay. Cause not only do I just say, Oh, I love this. Oh, it's great. It's awesome. No, we don't, we don't get down like that over here. I give you guys the pros and the cons of when I do reviews, I give you pros and cons. And when I do my favorites, I tell you why I love it. I don't just say, girl, I love it. It's awesome. Mm -mm. We go into it. What's the, what's the six, six feet? Is that what you're saying? Oh, okay. I feel like a smoky eye, you can rock. I'm like dancing. It's like I got a song in my head. But I think a smoky eye is great for all eye shapes because even hooded lids, it makes it look like it's bigger than what it is. And you can do a smoky eye with any color. You can absolutely leave ideas once it's posted. Absolutely. I welcome your ideas. Here's the thing. I welcome ideas. I welcome constructive criticism. It's just when people start to get a little rude with it and a little kind of demanding or just downright rude, that's when I delete comments. But if you are giving constructive criticism, because I mean, no one knows at all. You understand what I'm saying? And how will you grow if you don't have constructive criticism? So I welcome all that. I welcome your ideas because, you know, we're growing together. It's not just my channel. I feel like we're growing together. So I definitely welcome your ideas. And then how will I know what y'all want to see if you don't tell me, you know? So, um, oh no. You may need to see if you're using something on your eyes that's making it run. Uh, 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 I, ooh, I can read all that real quick. Hooded lids. I actually have a video coming. I don't know if you guys follow me on Snapchat, but um, my friend Hope, I call her Hopey. We went to Ipsy Studios and we filmed a video because she was like, you know, I have hooded lids and I don't know what to do. I need you to give me some tips. I did her makeup for her wedding like three years ago as well, but she was like, Hey, Minnie. But she was like, I really need to, I just need you to give me a go-to look that I can create on my own. So I did her makeup. I did her makeup on her hooded lids or maybe even semi-hooded lids. Cause she's like, every time I do my eyeshadow, when I open my eyes, it's all gone. So I did a little smoky eye on her. I used the Jaclyn Hill palette because she bought one and she said she wanted to know and be able to refer to the video to know how to do it. So I just have to edit that video and it will be up because you guys said you, you know, I told her, I said, let's record it because people want to know about hooded lids as well. So, um, so yeah, so that's coming. I got a hooded lids video coming. I have, which is, it's a transformation makeup tutorial as well so i have that coming i have um a video coming about fashion nova i have a video coming on my units i have a favorites video coming all these four like all four of these videos are done i just have to edit them i've already filmed them faith you are absolutely right because it could be it could be and never try a bunch of products at one time i do it but <laughs> listen you know, I'm saying don't do it. I do it sometimes, but if you're having a problem, try different products at different times so you can know what's causing it. Absolutely. Um, st how to stop oxidization. Oxid oxidization. Did I say that right? First off, it could be your chemicals reacting to the foundation. So just make sure it's not the foundation. It could be too old. If your foundation is older than like a year and a half, sometimes you can get away with it, but most companies recommend that they have like an expiration date on it. Make sure you check that, especially when it comes to foundations and concealers and stuff like that. Check the expiration date because sometimes the products that they have mixed together that bind together after a certain amount of time, 
they begin to like separate or they begin to react and you don't want to break out or anything like that. I ain't gonna lie though. I have foundations like longer than a year and a half. If they don't stink, if they haven't oxidized, if they still, you know, do me right, then I have worn them. But just make sure you check that and make sure it's like not too old. And then sometimes there's foundations that I've tried that they just, um, that brand just oxidizes on me so I don't wear it. But listen, hold on. This lipstick, yeah. You gotta check yourself, especially with that matte. Don't do the matte with it. Mm -mm. I don't recommend that. Not together. I missed the last comment because I had a situation. And then I'm gonna close for the third time. <laughs> yeah, so you gotta you gotta be careful with that. Yes. Yeah, so my friend Hopi, that video will be coming. She's watching. She's watching. She she and she 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 got her mama back. I'll just say that. So that is it, you guys. And you guys make sure you follow Mini Me on um on her social media too. She's on Instagram as a dot Monet, and she does these um. Dang, what does she call them? She ha is is a Monet speaks, and she actually gives like encouraging thoughts or um uh I don't even know how I want to say it thoughts. Um, maybe even scripture sometimes and just these posts of different things that she's learned and how she's grown and different things that actually inspire people. It inspires me as well. Quotes. There you go, Minnie. She does quotes every Tuesday on Instagram. So she type in your name. Well, just like her name right there, A Monet on Instagram. So check her out and that's what she does. So yeah. Um, Mac, I don't know if you asked me about Mac. I'm NC. Yes, I love them too. And when, if I miss some of her posts, she'll tell you. I go back and I'm like, 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 like. Because listen, that's my baby. If I don't support her, who's going to support her? You know what I'm saying? So just show her a little love. But as far as MAC, I wear NC45 and NC50. And I'm going to follow you. Um, I don't know if you say your name, Taiwan. I think it's Taiwan. So anyway, I'm going to follow her. And I am going to let you know that I'm about to head on out of here so that y'all can enjoy y'all Saturday. I can enjoy my Saturday. And um, yeah, I love y'all. Yes, y'all. I'm like, y'all see me glistening? I'm like, I'm like, whoo. Yeah. Oh, girl. Yeah. That foundation. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm really, these lights are like, yeah. So anyway, I love you guys so much. I appreciate all of your support. Make sure like you share the channel and thumbs up you guys so that because thumbs ups, they really, 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 really help. It actually shares the channel and it promotes the channel. And we're trying to get to 100K and we're almost there. And when I do get there, I'm going to be doing a huge giveaway, girl. OK, so I thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today and stay tuned for all the other videos. And you guys have an awesome, blessed day on purpose, on purpose purpose. All right. And then I'll see you guys sooner than you think, probably tomorrow morning here on YouTube. Okay. And on Snapchat right now. All right. Bye you guys.